Hello, welcome back to another piano tutorial. Today we're learning Too Good at Goodbyes by Sam Smith. This song has a nice piano in it. Uh, it's a pop song, so it's only about four chords, and it's really simple to learn. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright, I'm going to play the first couple of measures in the song so you get an idea of what the song sounds like, and you can see how repetitive this song actually is. So let's get into it. So your first chord in the song will be D minor or D minor 7 if you want to add the C. By the way, here's middle C, right in the middle of the piano. So we have uh, D, F, and A in your left hand with C, D, F, and A in your right. Again, you don't have to add the C, but it's optional if you want to make it sound uh, warmer, I guess. So first chord, D minor 7. Then you switch over to a C, uh, excuse me, an F major chord. Which is F, A, or excuse me, F and C in your left hand with A, C, and F in your right hand. So you did this one and two and three and four and one and two and three and so on. Next chord you're gonna have is a C, uh, C major chord. Uh, so we were, we were here. I like this C major chord, which is C and E in your left hand with. G, C, and E in your right. Next is a, um, you can either do this uh, one or two ways. You can either do a G minor 7 chord, which I think, I, oh, what did I do? It was this. Yeah, so if you're doing a G minor 7 chord, you're going to have G, a B flat, and D in your left with F, B flat, and D in your right. If you don't want to do that G minor 7 chord and just do like a regular standard chord, you can either do G minor or B flat major. Personally, G, G minor sounds better, so let's do G minor. So you have 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and yeah. And those are your four chords. He does this thing in every measure that this chord happens. so. Like I said, it's repetitive. So you have D minor, F, then you do this. And all you're doing is playing one and, uh, for C major, excuse me, C major, one and two and three and four. So on the end of three, you're gonna hit this G again. And then switch to the G major, or excuse me, G minor seven or G minor chord. So one and two and three and four and. and Thank you guys for enjoying this video. If you do like what I do on this channel, consider subscribing and like the video if you do like Sam Smith. I'm asking you in the comments, what song should I play next? Please leave your opinion right there. And I'll see you guys in the next one.